morning, YouTube. A little messy today, but give you a little rundown on what's going on today. Um, so today we're gonna be doing a bunch of bunch of jobs today. We're gonna go trim an oak tree off a driveway the right way. Um, we're just gonna start rubbing each other. So I'm gonna get that out of here. I'm gonna clean this stuff up for you a little bit. And we're gonna boogie on down to the next job. it to a quarter pitch chain and uh, it's a 12 inch bar I ported the cylinder with a big bore kit um, adjusted the carburetor modified the exhaust and uh, advanced the timing on the flywheel um, so I just want to show you driveway there properly and uh, I noticed that she had this one limb hanging over the house it's hat rack that's why it's all pushy at the end right here so I'm gonna take that off and uh, make it right close off that wound at the end there when you hat rack them you don't you, you just cut it off at the end and leave a giant nub and what happens is it grows a bunch of spurs or sprouts at the end so eventually you're gonna have six or eight limbs off the end of that one limb and it makes it so heavy that they're 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 vulnerable to break and fall through the roof or whatever it's hanging over also it, it, it opens the tree up for disease and decay so that limb could also just eventually just decay and just be bad. It's bad for the tree to hat rack. Don't hat rack, all right? So if you see down there at the end, the French left hand, at the end there, they just chopped it off. Basically like this, right? And they left it out there. That's, that's really not good for the tree. So we're gonna remove this limb here and that'll be that. Nicely done guys, nicely done. And this is what I'm talking about. That's hat rack. That, that's dying. That's no good. No, no, no good. Decided to make a couple coasters real quick. Dry them out a little bit.
another win right there that was hat rack too that we took out. Got her looking right.